Guys, I don't know what it is you're doing, but whatever it is, stop. I have a guaranteed winner, $1 billion. Are you talking about a lottery ticket? Mike, the odds of winning the lotto are 1 in 259 million. We just Googled it this morning when we were debating on whether or not to buy lotto tickets or Snickers bars. Lotto tickets lost. No, I'm not talking about the lotto. I'm talking about $1 billion cash. March Madness, my bracket is spot on. Check it out. I don't know if you guys are up under current events, but Jimmy Buffett has offered to pay a billion dollars to whoever has the winning NCAA tournament bracket. Warren. Warren Buffett, not Jimmy Buffett. Warren, whatever. Yeah, we know about this. Everyone does, okay? Problem is, it's April, Mike. This was supposed to be sent out a while ago. Yeah, like over a month ago? Look, I know, all right? But I've thought of every possible angle here, okay? And I've got it covered. Trust me, my bracket is 100% correct. Check it out. Oh, you actually thought Dayton was going to beat Ohio State? According to my bracket, I did. Okay. First of all, can we stop saying the word bracket? Nails on a chalkboard. Second of all, what, it, is that whiteout? You better believe it. Guys, listen, you're not getting this, okay? My bracket is 100% correct. I think what you're not getting is that there was a deadline. This was supposed to be sent out already. And one can only assume that since it's sitting right here in front of us, that you haven't put it in the mail yet? Nope. And you want to know why? I got a guy who works at the post office. He agreed to roll back the postmark date. Go ahead. Down me. Okay. But also, I think it was supposed to be emailed in. It's Jimmy Buffett, you guys. Warren. Warren. Whatever. He's like a thousand years old. You think he's going to notice some whiteout? And he'll probably be ecstatic to get a letter in the mail. Look, we already know it's going to be Florida, Yukon, Wisconsin, and Kentucky in the Final Four. Okay, my guy in Vegas already texted me the odds. And as long as this is postmarked by the deadline, which it will be, it's a for sure thing. I already won. And actually, I'm so sure of it that I already bought a few things. Bought things like... Cars! You certainly don't mean these cars. I certainly do. When I was 15, my dad gave me a great piece of advice. He said, son, never buy new, always buy used. So I bought a whole used car lot and brought the inventory here. What'd you do, take out a loan? Of course I did. I haven't mailed in my bracket yet. And that's not all. Already in escrow. 2.5 million on a short sale. Cash, suck it bank. Oh, hang on. Mike's office, Mike speaking. Hey. What's up, man? Smack me in the face so that I'm not imagining all this. Bill, what's up? What? Oh, man. Oh, no, dude, no problem. You can crash with me. Yeah, look, I got eight bedrooms in the new house I bought. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Huh. Who was that? That was my buddy Bill from the post office. He just got fired. So I, you know, I told him he could stay in my new place until he gets back on his feet. Jeez. What? Cheers. <laughs>